Welcome to the DPRC Accessible Media Program's LiveScribe Echo Smart Pen Video Training Series. The SF State DPRC has created these videos to quickly help you get up and running with your new LiveScribe Echo Smart Pen. If you have any questions about your pen or like one-on-one -on -one training with a DPRC Adaptive Technology Trainer, just ask. The DPRC is here to help. The LiveScribe Echo Smart Pen is a powerful audio recording note-taking tool. Over the course of this video series, we will teach you how to use the LiveScribe Echo Smart Pen and how to leverage its powerful note-taking features. At the heart of the Echo Smart Pen note-taking experience is the ability to digitally record your notes, both the audio and your handwriting. The Smart Pen automatically connects your meeting or lecture audio to your handwriting. Simply tap on any note to hear the audio playback. Experience is the ability to digitally record your notes, both the audio and your handwriting. The Smart Pen automatically connects your meeting or lecture audio to your handwriting. Before we begin, please make sure you've checked out your DPRC issued LiveScribe Echo Smart Pen. If you still need to get your Smart Pen, head over to the DPRC main office in SSB 110 and ask the front desk for assistance. After watching this video series, you will be able to set up your LiveScribe Echo Smart Pen and Notebook. Customize your LiveScribe Echo Smart Pen, Notebook, and software according to your preferences. Record and replay the, the audio sessions. Men. Navigate the pen's menu and use some advanced features of the pen. Edit, catalog, and share files with the LiveScribe Echo desktop software. Each DPRC-issued Smart Pen Kit includes the LiveScribe Smart Pen, a spare ink cartridge, a USB cable, and storage case. A set of four numbered dot paper notebooks will also be provided by the DPRC. If you are taking more than four classes, the DPRC can provide up to eight unique notebooks. Small numbered black starter notebooks are available for DPRC students who would like to carry less weight. Now, let's take a closer look at your LiveScribe Echo Smart Pen system. Smart Pen is a ballpoint pen built around a tiny computer. At the tip of your pen is a small camera that takes pictures of the patented dot pattern in the LiveScribe notebook. This is how the pen records its position on the page. A removable ink cartridge. The nib of the pen is a self-contained ink cartridge. When it runs dry, you can replace it with another a microphone and speaker. At the center of the pen is a microphone. The microphone is used to record the audio used in your notes. Next to the microphone is a speaker. The speaker can replay the audio of your notes you've recorded. The smart pen automatically connects your meeting. A small OLED display. The pen's display helps you navigate the pen's menu as well as display other important information about the pen's state like the battery level. A USB and headphone jack. The USB jack of the pen is used to transfer files to your computer, as well as recharge the battery. Great! Let's begin by activating your pen and linking it to your first notebook. When you are ready, pick up your pen. Remove the plastic cover that protects the camera. Make sure to keep this cover somewhere safe. To turn on the pen, press and hold the power button. Grab one of your new notebooks. Notice the seal binding the notebook shut. Tap and hold on the seal until your pen says that the notebook is ready for use. This notebook is available for use on your smart pen. You are now ready to take notes with your smart pen. Before we move on, we need to cover an important technical aspect 
of how the smart pen system works and why we need to tap on that seal. The smart pen is able to record its position on the note page by taking pictures with the infrared camera of the tiny dots printed on the smart pen paper. Each numbered notebook, one through eight, has a unique set of dots. This is what the numbers actually refer to. When you register a pen to a particular numbered notebook, it is associating the dot pattern in that notebook to the notes you write. Therefore, it is not possible to use two of the same numbered notebooks at the same time. If you were able to do this, the pen would not know which notebook a particular note is assigned to. If you try to register the same notebook, the pen will warn you that this is not possible. This dot paper is already active on your smart pen. You may be asking yourself what happens when you fill up all your notebooks. When you are ready to use a new same numbered notebook, you can archive the previous notebook on your computer using the LiveScribe Echo software. Once you archive the previous notebook, the pen will allow you to register a new same numbered notebook. We will cover this in the third video. But what makes a smart pen so helpful for taking notes? It can be challenging during a class or a meeting to listen to other people, think about what they are saying, and write it down all at the same time. The smart pen helps reduce this workload. It simultaneously records everything that is said and everything you write down. The audio that is recorded is directly associated with what you write in your notebook. You can come back at any time, tap on a note, and hear what the pen recorded. You'll never miss anything. Tap on a note and hear what the pen recorded. You'll never miss anything. This concludes our introductory smart pen training video. In the next video, we will help you set up your pen and show you how to take notes using the Cornell note taking system. If you have any questions, please contact the DPRC. Hope to see you soon.